Montana man claims he has proof that UFOs are real in two photographs captured by powerful cameras. The truth is out there. A Montana man claims to have positive proof of alien life after capturing images of two UFOs on camera. Dr. Richard O'Connor's images of two unidentified flying objects were snapped on November 4th with two powerful motion capture cameras he keeps pointed at the sky. The five photos show two smooth, cylindrical objects that appear to be moving through the sky at high speed. Basically what you see is a very symmetrical, smooth and reflective surface that appears to have his own light source, O'Connor told Detroit Free Press. In my opinion, even a hardened skeptic would say, well, that is what I expect a UFO would look like. O'Connor estimates his two Reconyx Hyperfire PC-900 trail cameras have taken more than 280,000 photos since he installed them. When triggered by motion, the cameras shoot 20 photos at approximately one-second intervals. Skeptics say the images are fake. But O'Connor, who worked as an anesthesiologist at St. Peter's Hospital in Helena before retiring, insists he has no knowledge of how to digitally manipulate photos on a computer. Mexican senior citizen claims UFO attempted to abduct him. O'Connor, 60, has shared the pictures with the National UFO Reporting Center, who have a website listing UFO sightings by state. Peter Davenport, the head of the New Fork, sent the photos to a skilled photo analyst who described the photos as real, but remain a mystery. I suspect the lights in the first and last photos are sun reflections off of something rather than any propulsion system, the photo analyst wrote. But a second analyst disagreed and declared the photos 100% fake. Breaking news. O'Connor maintains the photos are genuine and said what you see there is what came off that camera. He said his main intention is to let people know that UFOs are real. These photographs are proof positive that UFOs are real. I am interested in the truth, he added. If I am subject to criticism to get to the bottom of this, then I guess it's part of the deal. O'Connor was friends with renowned UFO believer Jesse Marcel Jr. for more than 25 years and says his friend inspired his belief in UFOs. Marcel Jr. claimed that when he was 10 years old, his father brought home wreckage from the alleged Roswell crash in New Mexico in July 1947.